Tom, where are we? Well, we arrived in Thailand. Yeah. Sawadika. Hola, chicos. Bienvenido a mi canal una semana más. Today's video is going to be in English so that Tom can vlog with me. So if you don't understand English very well, yes. you can activate subtitles down here. Subtitles on. No speak Spanish. <laughs> we just arrived um, today to Phuket, Thailand. Last minute trip, very unexpected. We are actually here because we're going on a cruise in two days yep. on a yacht tour for seven days around lots of islands. So we decided to come two days early and we're in Phuket now yeah, for two just days. Have some, have some downtime, do some exploring, shopping and yeah. Yeah, just see the sights really. So we just arrived this morning really early at like what, eight? We were already yeah. in the hotel. We, we flew for about yeah. we're door staying... to door. It was probably about 20, 24 hours. It was like really long. We flew with Qatar via Doha. Yeah. So uh, it was quite a long trip. Yeah. But it was, it was nice. We expected to be really tired. We were actually quite rested, so that's yeah, okay. Yeah, we both slept on the plane. And good. yeah, we arrived really early, but they let us check in our room really early. So uh, we've been able to have it since we arrived at 8 at the hotel. Yeah. We're staying at the Bliss, uh, which the is Bliss in Patong. Hotel. They gave us a really nice suite. Uh, with a jacuzzi, which we'll show you later, yeah. and uh, we're really loving it. So, um, just hoping it's not going to rain too much because it's the monsoon season. Mm. Uh, so it's supposed to be the worst <laughs> yeah. time of the we year. We looked at, to we come looked to at the graphs, and September was the peak of rainfall throughout the entire yeah. year, wasn't it? <laughs> I think we'll be okay. <laughs> Let's be go and explore and see what yeah. happens. What do you think of our hotel room? Have you seen the jacuzzi? Yeah. Have you seen it? We need to see it again. I mean. Thailand. There's two trips now to Thailand. We've had a jacuzzi. So this is Patong Beach. There behind the motorbikes. <laughs> and our hotel is at that end of the beach, just a few meters away. Out, it was really humid and hot. <laughs> we walked around, saw some shops, and then we decided to come to a mall. It's called Junk Ceylon. A few nice shops, uh, but we're really tired. It's only 1 pm and we are feeling the jet lag <laughs> really hard already. <laughs> so we stopped for this, which is a um, like ice tea. Like it's really nice. I had it the first time I came to Thailand. Like a cappuccino tea. Really good. Um, yeah, it's like black tea but like iced. It's nice. Nice and strong. So yeah, I think we're gonna chill, then probably find something to eat. And then we might go to a hotel and have a little siesta. You're like dying. I'm very sleepy. I'm just like, I could fall asleep in this chair right now. <laughs> Hello again, it's like, what, 8pm? Yeah, right. Um, basically, we were really tired and hungry. We went to get some takeaway fried rice and some... Samosas. What's the other one? Samosas. And then we brought all the food to the hotel, ate it and just chilled. And then we went to sleep thinking, oh, let's just have like a one hour siesta. And we ended up taking a like, what, three or four hour nap? Yeah. <laughs> um, basically, Asia is like the worst place ever when it comes to jet lag. So we were really, really tired. And we thought, you know what, well, let's just sleep because we couldn't even be bothered moving. Um, so we just got up a while ago. We've just been relaxing and we're going to go out to get a massage mm -hmm. um, and then probably get dinner and drinks. Um, yeah, this bed is Amazing. terrible because it's so comfortable that you just can't get up. So big as well, look. Look how big it is. <laughs> Tom loves it. <laughs> and this is what I'm wearing. It's really hot, so I like wearing this type of pants at night because they're really like fresh, you know. So, we just got a Thai massage. Yeah. 
We pay oh, yeah. what 250 baht each? Uh, yep, 250. Which is like five pounds. It's insane. For a full hour. For a one hour time massage. Oh my god. Um, now you can get you can get an oil massage instead or like foot massage, head massage, whatever. But we like the time one. Yeah, it's, can, quite, it's really tough. Like, yeah, it can be a bit really painful. like moving your body around and pushing and cracking. If, and, if but, you're oh, like gosh, very so sensitive. It can so, yeah. be a bit painful. For it can be a bit much. Fine. But you just I really like it. Relax into it, breathe. Yeah. And you just come out feeling like t I feel ten years younger. <laughs> I feel three inches taller. Yeah. <laughs> so, so yeah, good. that was totally worth it. Yeah, it was. So we came to a place called East Restaurant, and we're gonna have dinner and a coconut. Because a coconut is always a good idea, as well as a single beer. Tom's having pad thai. Pad thai. So we just got a foot massage Amazing. that included an egg massage and back massage and yeah. leg massage for like 180 back. Which is that nothing. was so cheap. And now we're in a Nutella pancake. And then we're going to sleep because it's midnight <laughs> and we're jet lagged. I can see on your face that you're like, I'm like looking forward to the Nutella pancake. I am, but I'm also looking forward to the bed sleeping. Good morning! Second day in Phuket and we just, well, we didn't just get up. It's like 8.30 or something like that. I've been up since like 5 in the morning because we're all super jet lagged. So we're now heading to breakfast. Aren't we Tom? Yes, you ready? we are. We're going to show you the breakfast because we um, had breakfast yesterday and it was really good. It's been raining a lot this morning. I think it's stopped now. Um, but it was really windy last night. It was like a hurricane. Literally, and um, as you can see, it's all wet, so um, it will probably rain again later. So, this is where our room is. We're on the first, well, second floor, and we have this pool right here, which is really nice. We had a swim yesterday, and then there's another pool on the other side of the hotel, I think over there, or like over there. Um, we, we'll try that one today. What do you think, Tom? Should we try the other pool today? By the way, I bought these sandals yesterday. They're like the Birkenstocks, but I paid 300 baht for them, which is like seven pound and a half. Not too bad. Sun's kinda come out. Still very windy. Very suspicious. I don't know what they're doing, but they have a stick and they were like hitting something in the water before. So we're a bit worried because I don't know what they're doing. But... There's a bottle there, so there's obviously like a fishing net. So maybe it was like a. Maybe they're just fishing. I don't know. So here we are, day two in Tong. Um, just had just ordered some lunch and this nice restaurant on the beach. And tonight we're going for dinner uh, at a nice restaurant and tomorrow we're getting the yacht. So let's all go. Bon appetit! So we just arrived at the hotel. Um, again, we're still super jet like the entire, so we thought let's just go to the pool, you know, because we're in beach bum mode right now. Um, so this is our room. I haven't shown you before. This is the living room. Excuse the mess. Um, this the kitchen there, and a little desk, and then we walk into the bedroom, which has a massive bed. This is the most comfortable bed I have ever slept in. And I've been to lots of hotels. Um, that's the <laughs> mess. And that's the um, balcony. Got a little TV here. Wardrobe. And then the best part of it is the bathroom. Look at this. Isn't it amazing? And it has a jacuzzi. Yay. We haven't used it yet. We should probably use it today before we go. And that's like a rain shower. So yeah, this is our room. We love it. Um, we really like this hotel, honestly. Everyone's so nice. 
the room is incredible. It has two pools and it's right in Patong, so I'm really happy. And the bed is the best. <laughs> the best part. The bed is Tom loves the bed too. You know what I love is that you can lie like that and I don't even have to touch you. <laughs> I love you, you too, Tom. Be that far away from me and have that because I love my space. Yeah, me too. And you know cuddling. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, let's um, get changing, go to the pool, shall we? Sounds splendid. Put the strap on. Ooh, if it falls, you're dead. Ooh. See what I deal with every day? Anyway, so we're at the pool, at the hotel. We're doing some photography. Well, I'm trying to do some photography. So I thought I'd set up the camera uh, so you can see the madness that ensues behind the scenes with this crazy munchkin. <laughs> Here we are, poolside. We're gonna do some behind the scenes action of Anna and I trying to take some photography. This one is being a very tough study. She's a diva. I'm so entitled. But let's do it. We bought this new lens. Um, what's it called, Anna? It's, like, it's called a dome port. It's called a dome port. Got it from Amazon. Links in the bio. Um, and basically, what it does is it puts the surface of the lens away from the actual lens, about that far, so that you, when you shoot half in and half out of the water, you actually see the depth of field of the water and then the depth of field of sky. Do I sound like I know what I'm talking about? No idea what I'm talking about. I'm just saying fancy words, hoping you'll understand. So this evening we went to a lovely restaurant in Patong and we booked this thanks to eTable Asia which is a website where you can see menus and photos and reviews um, even book a table and buy vouchers for the best restaurants in town um, I really recommend this if you're looking to have fancy dinners while you're in Phuket We went to a restaurant called Ninth Floor that had an amazing view of Patong and we had a delicious fondue, we had risotto, a couple of cocktails and the best dessert it was really great, we really enjoyed having dinner there. So we just came back from dinner, that was really amazing. I enjoyed it so much. And now um, we were talking to the taxi driver about the tsunami because um, obviously we were aware that the tsunami hit this area pretty badly in 2004. But yesterday we saw like a memorial um, stone thing for the tsunami victims and we started like um, reading about it and all the consequences that it had in this area of Phuket apparently it was really bad we were talking to a taxi driver and he told us that this hotel uh, because it's on the beach front it was actually um, the old building was like destroyed by the tsunami and you can still see the building next to our hotel um, the lower floors are like completely destroyed and they're like rebuilding it again so they had to build a new hotel next to it which is crazy I, I cannot imagine how devastating that must have been um so yeah that's really sad and here's tom hola chicos so i think now we're gonna have a bath and we're gonna pack because tomorrow morning we have jacuzzi we <laughs> yes a jacuzzi bath uh because tomorrow morning we have to leave pretty early because we're starting our yacht tour with Woo! blanco yacht tour so um, I'll leave the website down below, but um, keep an eye on our next video because it's going to be amazing. It's just crazy. It's a seven day um, trip around like 13 islands like that. Um, off the coast of Phuket. So it's just going to be incredible. We're so excited awesome. about it. Yeah, it's going to be brilliant. <laughs> Let's go have a bath. Yes. Bye.